basically I love hot food and I love uh, hot sauces. I tried all the sauces in the market. There was nothing that was tasty enough for me. And one day I made this recipe at, at home and I said, wow, this is a really amazingly tasty hot sauce. And that's how the, the, the sauce was created. And then my son booked up a show um, and uh, we started bottling it at, at home um, and made uh, sort of a thousand units and, and the BBC Good Food show. And that's, that's how we knew that we had a product which could sell and that's how the business started. I believe the LBA is a special initiative because it recognises local business and you know sometimes we're a local business and you're working hard, uh, you know you don't necessarily look out from, from the blinkers, you know it's nice to know that if you work hard and you work honestly with a clean heart and you believe in what you're doing people will say you know what these guys are trying to do something and we'll recognise them for that. Um, the advertising obviously is priceless in the sense you know, small businesses may not have the budget to do that type of advertising but also you never know who reads the paper, who will pick it up and who will see your brand and get in contact with you. Uh, so that's quite exciting and then the, the final aspect of it is the mentoring. You know, when, when you are an entrepreneur or you're trying to run your own business, a lot of the time you're making it up as you're going along, going along. you're reading books and you're trying to understand what you're doing. And, to have someone who's been there and done it and worn the t-shirt to say to you, well, look, this is actually what might happen or consider this is in itself priceless. We were fortunate enough to be introduced to someone called Lance Foreman, and he runs uh, Foreman's Fishery, one of the oldest salmon smokeries in the country. It's been around for over 100 years, and it's inspiring to see a, a, a business generations old because that's what we want to do. I want to pass this business on to my kids and my grandkids. Um, so he's really been good in giving us advice and help on questions we may have had or challenges we've faced. And at the same time, he made some introductions which we've worked quite hard on and off the back of it, managed to secure new business in New York uh, for Mr. Singh. So, you know, we're now truly international. We export to South Africa already, but we're now exporting to America uh, and to New York. So we're going to go there in a couple of months uh, to maximize that business opportunity and it's a huge bonus that's come out of uh, the, the, the LBA and the, the mentoring opportunity. Our future ambitions for Mr. Singh's um, are very, very ambitious and very exciting. We want to sell a million units of our products as soon as we can and we believe we can do it. Uh, we've secured listing with Ocado, uh, we're already in Harvey Nichols, Morrisons, uh, plenty of local independent uh, retailers and we're in talks with a couple of the other supermarkets as well which we are very confident on, as well as the international listings we have uh, will help us become a major British brand and that's what we want to do. And for myself personally, I want to create a business uh, for generations. I want to pass this on to my children and my grandchildren and you know, have it established as, a, as, a, as an original uh, brand that lasts the uh, test of time, basically.